Hey guys, just wanted to do a little update here. Getting the plow equipment ready for this upcoming season. Um, as you can see, it's been a while since I've done a video. Um, the Fisher HT I added pro wings to it last season. Ran those all season and she did well. Uh, this season, I just bought this Fisher XLS brand new with the new headlights and all. Um, and I just added this truck. It's a 06 2500 HD. Um, picked it up with less than 10,000 miles on it. Original miles. Real clean. Uh, no scratches. Sorry about the camera shake. And overall, a great looking truck. Um, so yeah, I added the Fisher XLS. I'm going to go outside do a little walk around. Sorry about the wind. She's brand new. Ready for action. Still getting used to the controls. Um, shouldn't take too long. Just everything expands out to 10 feet and angles the lead wing and the trail wing and all that. Um, so it should be really productive this coming winter and cut down my time a lot on a lot of the driveways and whatnot. Uh, other half tons still doing good. Um, like I said, I added the pro wings. That's sitting at about nine foot four inches now. Um, stock blade seven and a half foot, so almost two feet more in plowing width. So yeah, I just brought them out today. Um, added some fluid to the HT plow. Uh, cleaned that up, gave it a wash and a wax, lubricated all the hinge points, and just went over the general maintenance of it. I normally uh, do an oil change on the plows every season. This will be the first year I'm not changing the fluid on the HT. I'm going to try to go every other year on it. Um, just because I don't feel like the fluid was that dirty and I don't feel like there's really any moisture in the system. So. Just going to try every other year. So that's it. As you can see, there's new headlight styles. It's the new ones, the new Nightfire, or whatever they're called, that Fisher came out with this year. It's supposed to be brighter in low beam and much brighter in high beam compared to the old ones right there. Um, the HT is going on. This is the fifth season with it now. Um, still running strong. Really no problems with it. Just a couple of cartridge valves in the hydraulic pack that went. Um, but nothing serious. Yeah, hoping that the new XLS will last just as long and even longer. Oh yeah, the trucks, like I said, only 10,000 miles now. So I'm hoping to get a long life out of it. She's uh, just a regular standard cab, 8-foot box. Got it lettered up a couple weeks ago. Uh, back rack's probably going to go on it pretty soon. Uh, with new light bar mounted to it and all that stuff. Here's kind of a side view of the truck. Um, yeah, so it's fall, um, October 24th, 25th, something like that. Um, so it's about time that I bring everything out and get it ready. Fall cleanups are going to start pretty soon. We'll get those all handled up and be ready for the winter. Alright guys, stay tuned. I'm going to have more plow videos out this year. I know last year I didn't have any. Just had that one video of mountain the plow, but we really didn't have a lot of snow last year. We still had 100 inches, but it wasn't like the normal seasons where it stays here. Um, yeah, so we got these two trucks right now. Um, my dad also runs his 2500. It's a 2012 with a Fisher. Um, so... Yeah, we'll have three plows going. All right, guys, stay tuned. Thanks for watching.